Well, Lucky, welcome to Australia. You're enjoying your time so far? Yeah, I'm having a blast. Thank you. Absolutely. Well, it's lovely to have you here for the GQ Man of the Year Awards tonight. You became a father last year to gorgeous, gorgeous gravity. How has it changed you as a man? Oh, man, it changed me in the craziest ways. It just, it made me 20 times more emotional. Like, I'll cry at literally anything now. Anything can make me cry. Um, the notebook, just sob. <laughs> yeah, 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 seriously. Um, it's just made me more patient and understanding and like just put perspective like if, I don't know just put life into perspective like just my mom and like my dad of what they like all they've done for me it made me really realize that like not to be like gross or anything but like I'll get poop on my hands you know what I'm saying and like I think like I just like to think like that's a crazy moment because like I don't know. It's just shit a, unless you really loved your daughter. Yeah, it's really, it's made me really appreciate my mom and dad and stuff like that. So it's just like shaped me in the way of just like understanding life and just being a little more like, I don't know, there in the moment, I guess. You know? I think too, especially having a child is a very different world changing nappies to the modeling world that you've been a part of since you're scouted at 10 or 12, weren't you? Um, so who's the brand that you worked with that you first pinched yourself and when I can't believe I've locked in this campaign? Um, it was with Tom Ford. It was like the first one. I was just like, "Wow, this is pretty crazy." I didn't, I didn't think I could do this, you know. Yeah. And you've been on the cover of GQ's internationally. You, you've graced a few covers. What is it about the brand that means something to you? Um, Tom Ford. No, about GQ. Oh, oh, sorry, my bad. No, GQ. Oh, GQ. Like, I mean, when I hear GQ, it just, um, it just um, like reminds me of like classiness and like being a gentleman and like taking care of yourself and so it's just an honor to be on the cover of a publication that's about that it's like I don't know I still think of myself as like this younger like version of me you know what I'm saying so it's been a, it's been cool